happily scratching South Africa off my bucket list. I honestly can't even believe I get to say that I went to South Africa. But I'm about to take y'all with me on this flight there. We have landed in Atlanta. Now we have to get on another flight to Johannesburg. How many hours is that? Yeah. 16 hour flight. Yeah, fun day. Yes. So we will be at our destination tomorrow. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> The next stop is for E gates. E as an echo. Flying Delta Premium Select, I felt like I was that girl and that girl and felt like I was that girl even more with the leg space, the warm towels to clean my hands and face, all the stuff y'all we were able to take home. We had headphones, we had slippers. You name it, we had it. And then the food, we had three course meals throughout the entire flight, like breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And thank God that they had good movies to pick from because the flight was long as hell. I cannot even lie to you. Y'all. I was nervous to even fly this long. Huge, huge, huge shout out to Delta Select because they kept us tipsy. They kept us full. Yeah, it was just a whole entire experience. And I'm so glad to be able to say that I actually... It got to experience this. And no, my seat did not go all the way back because that's Delta One. But trust me when I say I will get there. I will make it there one day and then I'll be right here, back here with y'all making another vlog about Delta One. For us to be on an airplane, you guys, I really do have to give props to the food. And after all this, we still have 13 hours to go. What? <laughs> Delta had us covered with breakfast, and to be honest, it was actually pretty good. Now I'm short and got little legs, so all this walking was doing me in. We have landed South Africa. Just got off a 16-hour flight. Now we got one more. Each airport just got bigger by the second. I swear, I don't know if I was exhausted. I just couldn't catch my breath. You guys traveling through all this, but I was just so excited. We are finally in South Africa. I just uh, completely took that. I'm 100% that girlfriend that lags in the back and just sightseeing while her man thinks about everything. Yeah, that's me. My man always got me. You see, he's having his little fun. And I just had to. I had to. I had to do the trend, you guys. I just had to break out and run through the airport with my suitcase to show you how freaking excited I was. I told you Delta kept us together. Now, because we were heading to Africa, all of the foods that we were getting were native to their country. So that was pretty cool, too, because you got to start tasting Africa before you even got there. And there's my man again, carrying everything for me. And I know this is just supposed to be the flight, but I just had to show you guys a little bit of Gordon's Bay where we stayed. And this is close to Cape Town. So this is the very, very, very tippy end of South Africa, you guys. I was stunned, breath taken away every single day, like seriously. Imagine waking up and having the ocean in your front yard and then the mountains in the back. Literally crazy. Our Uber drivers were amazing. They gave us all types of information and history about the land that we were on, about their tribe, like about everything. They were just full of information. So if you have an Uber driver in another country and you don't ask them questions, you're crazy. I got a little emotional when we drove past the 10 homes because I really could not believe people were living like this, like porter potties for your everyday toilet. Like, I don't have anything to complain about. I'm sorry, God. I will never complain again. You know, we had to do a little bit of shopping, and our money in the U.S. is way more than theirs. So and this was in the center of the shopping. So we got to have a little bit of performance, got to see the culture, and I'm a culture, I'm a bunch of Time Out was a food court. I could not believe that this was a food court. We were getting oxtails. We were getting wine. We were getting anything that you can name in the food court. I had these wings and I could not get these wings. I probably had these wings like five times while we were in South Africa. Like I said, we had oxtails. We had all types of quesadillas, prawns. Like they're like 
you guys, the food courts. When I tell you this is the food court, there's a bunch of different places around, and then you sit in the middle, and everyone sits like picnic style. It was literally, I couldn't believe it. The whole time, I'm like, we're really at the food court at the mall. This is crazy. If you want to see more of my trip, just let me know down in the comments. Thanks for watching. Bye.